What do you think the child is doing? Pushing up. So how many of us really in love? How many of us really in love? Even if the mother don't want to pay attention. But because of what? The little child. You read Matthew 18, I think it is about when this unjust judge, this woman went to this unjust judge and was nagging the judge. Want a request. And the judge said, because of what, how this woman tried to, I'm paraphrasing, nagging me, I'm going to grant a request. When you have love, you push up yourself and those who don't want to be pushed on. Somebody can't say anything down there. That's what love does. <laughs> And I'm speaking from experience too, you know, because this is one man. If you think you don't want to talk to me, I'm going to talk to you. You don't have to answer me, but me, I'm going to talk to you. Because my heart is clean and free. You don't want to shake my hand, I'm coming to shake your hand. Because love is in this heart, somebody say, man. So we can claim that we love and we're not reaching out to people. You don't love nobody. You want to love yourself. Somebody say, man. And anything you love, you protect. Oh, Jesus. Why do you think some of us are afraid to get close because we love ourselves too much? Oh, oh. I don't want nobody to hurt me. You think if you have love flowing, people can hurt you? Nothing can destroy love. I mean, nothing can destroy genuine love. I mean, genuine love. Throw a ball on this wall. Bounce off. That's what love is like. But if you throw a, use a gun and shot it through. And if it got through, it means there was not enough love to counteract the shot. Oh, oh. It's a greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. But Virgin Testament says, time we love one another. It's time we love one another. It's time we begin to love each other. Somebody say, man, oh God Almighty. Hallelujah. Let me run on. Let me run on. Beloved, let us love verse seven. One another. For love is of God. Look at it now. And everyone that loveth is born of God. God. So how many born again believer is in church? Don't raise your hand. Because if I can't love you, I'm not born of God. Let's get in the Bible to the church of God. The Bible says, everyone that love it, that word love it means it continue to flow. Somebody praise him down here. Everyone that love it is born of God and know it God to know somebody is to acquaint yourself is to associate yourself is to live with her if I claim I know you there's some stuff I must know about you everyone that love it is born of God and know it God there's some things you'll get to know about God. As I said, it was done Tuesday. Because of how God treats you when you fail. And you're going to treat people like how God treats you. Uh oh Well, my brothers and sisters, this is where we have to leave you this evening. And I'm so glad. I, I trust you were blessed by the message. Amen, church of God. It's time to love one another. Amen. And if we cannot love our brothers and sisters down here there's no way we're going to heaven because love came from heaven to earth to bring man into a love relationship with the lord jesus christ and if you just tune in you're listening to the voice of deliverance broadcast coming to you from rescue the perishing deliverance ministries 455 rogers avenue brooklyn new york telephone number 347-435-3532 or my cell phone is 954-646-1017 if you don't have a church home and you're looking for somewhere to worship I encourage you to give us a visit right here at Rescue the Persian Deliverance Ministries, 455 Rogers Avenue, Brooklyn, New York. We are between Maple 
and Lincoln Road. Amen. And you can get me, if you need special prayer, you could call me right now on 954-646-1017. Wherever you're listening to me or watching me around the world via internet, call me 954-646-1017. You can also link me on Facebook. Just go to Delroy Chambers at Facebook.com. Amen. Join me on Facebook. Let's talk. You can also watch this program also on Facebook. Wonderful name of the Lord God. Again, join us next week, same time, for one more program. Hallelujah. The voice of deliverance broadcast. If you are not saved, pray this prayer. Ask Jesus Christ to come into your heart. Say, Lord Jesus, I am a sinner. Forgive me of my sins. Wash me now with your precious blood. Lord, I'm sorry for the things I've done wrong. If you ask Jesus in your heart, he will come in and transform your soul. Remember, Jesus is coming soon. He is coming back again. If you are not saved, hallelujah, ask him to save you. Don't go to hell when you can go to heaven. The Bible said, for all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. But the Bible also said, if we confess our sins, he is faithful and he is just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. I encourage you this evening. Whatever time you're watching this program, give your heart to Jesus Christ. He loves you. If you plan to go to heaven, you must be born again. So until next week, same time, this is Pastor Chamber saying, be blessed. As we close out with our choir singing a song, that will bless you. Again, you can give me a call. 954-646-1017. One seven again nine five four six four six one zero one seven. Be blessed until next week. Same time, same place. Stay tuned as our choir closes us out in Jesus' name. Lord, we come with our hearts wide open. Lord, we Hey!